Imagine a time when there was nothing. There was no Earth, no Sun, no solar system, no Milky Way galaxy. Not even a galaxy, not space, not a black hole or anything. There wasn't even what we call the universe. Such a thing is difficult to imagine. At that time somewhere a point was born. Hot point then suddenly the explosion. As a result of that explosion, energy was born, space was born, and time was also born. In the meantime, the energy and particles spread at an incredible speed. The elementary particles, i.e. electrons, quarks, muons, photons, gluons, etc., are born from fast energy. This is actually the birth of the universe. Then, as the baby universe expanded, its temperature began to decrease. The resulting elementary particles combine with each other to form complex particles protons and neutrons. They combine to form hydrogen atoms. The hydrogen atoms are clustered together like a thick cloud somewhere. In that cloud, gravitational force and nuclear force become active, energy is created. Stars are formed. In the course of time, galaxies are formed by the gathering of stars and the meeting of planets and satellites. Of course, galaxies are not formed only by the assembly of planets and satellites. This required a very heavy black hole. Such black holes can only form if a massive star dies. That is, the earliest stars form black holes after death. Numerous stars and satellites have crowded around them. Billions of such stars, including planet satellites, 